What is up, YouTube? This is Hidden Angel Lionheart coming to you from like 5 till 5 a.m. in the morning in the rec room. And I'm alone, so I'm allowed to be as loud as I freaking want. Woo! And in this special video, we are going to be doing one, the one of three astral quests you get when you're in Azteca starting at level 84 and it finishes at 80. Um. 84, 86, and then you get your main quest spell at 88, and then it continues to 88, I believe, and then 80, or 90, it's one of the two. But anyway, we're getting the first quest, and I believe this is for the enchantments, sun enchantment sipel, so let's see what Pakal Red Mask has to say. Come and find me in the Zokal, young visitor. I will share with you something of great interest. And I'm right beside you. I have surely seen the astral obelisks in three points. These are sacred to the moon, the stars, and the sun. Yes, indeed. Long ago, the wisest mystics of Azteca began the secrets of astral magic. They placed the teachings into the obelisks. Oh, my. To learn more about those ancient schools of magic, speak to Tezcatrista. He is our current expert in astral magic. Well, ain't that something? Ah, so yes, progress on my life is doing pretty well so far, and no, he is not stitched in gear yet, which I wish he was, but I only have one crown to my name, literally, so I really feel cheap. So, anywho, this video, I believe we are going to be fighting a myth, a myth boss, either a myth or death, and then he has like two minions, so it's a three-on-one fight. So this will be interesting, as a heads up for all. Thank you for your help, Magician. Anything we can do to unite the people in this time of strife is important. I will let King Aksaya know how you have helped this day. You may tell Pakal Redmask that you have my thanks. Okay, I think we just um messed up the quest, so I just kind of goofed. Okay, let's see. Um. Dang! I really just messed up. Oh, here we go. <laughs> okay, I really feel stupid right now. Apparently when I accepted the quest, it took me back to a side quest I had done originally. So, uh, yeah, we can officially say I goofed. <sighs> that could be any better. But anywho, life is somewhat okay, I guess, ish. Greetings, magician. Have you been stargazing of late? Yes. So this star quest would be called the third star on the left. Though they have been dormant for years, I believe that power still slumbers within the three astral school obelisks. That's true. The star school obelisk was the last to dwindle and go silent, and should be the easiest to revive. Spellbinders of old would wake the star obelisk by scattering stardust upon it. That might still work. <laughs> The last measure of stardust was buried with the last of the star mystics uh -oh. deep within the cenote. Oh gosh. Go to the cenote and seek out the glimmering chamber. With luck, when Mighty Black Sky has not yet risen from his death sleep. That I don't want to know about. We shall pause this. We be. The dreamless death sleep has ended. Oh gosh. Yep, myth boss, and I was wrong, his henchmen are fire, so this is gonna suck. Um, okay, so I'm either going to stay in the Wild Grave Striders, or switch up to, um, this for 10 extra mi Yeah, I'll we'll probably switch up to these pair of boots. I have no damage, but my resist to, um, myth actually comes up 10% more, and I'm like almost 60% immunity to, um, myth. So, this is probably a plus one advantage for us. So, I'm going to get us some music started, and then after this, we are probably... What the frick? What is up with this screen so far? Oh, okay. It's fine now. Okay, never mind. Alright, um, we're going to pause this and put some music on, and be sure to enjoy the video, guys. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 
There's nothing left